so yesterday or day before yesterday I came out here and this was supposed to be a buck in here but I noticed the buck was crawling fur which means that the buck was probably a pregnant doe I'd gotten them mixed up put them in the wrong cages so I put a nest box in here uh, she refused to put the put her fur in the nest box I came out later found two babies in the nest box and that was all and she refused to put her fur in the nest box then later I came out and uh, one of the babies was dead in the nest box and I came home this morning and I think there I think that there's a uh, like eight left in this pile here somewhere that's about the messiest damn nest I've ever seen I mean she's just sloppy as hell here I think I counted eight but I took out three dead ones so I had three dead babies out of that litter then I went down to this Doe's hutch who had had a litter and they were probably, I don't know, a couple weeks old or something. A little over a week. And I looked in there and I saw two of the babies were out hopping around in the cage outside of the nest box, which is the first time I'd seen them outside of the nest box. And then I looked in the nest box. And I never did get a head count, but I believe that there was six to eight of them in the nest box before but I looked in the nest box and I saw one more rabbit besides the two that had been out hopping around um, I'm like well what the hell happened to him and as you can see the does have chewed holes in the walls of the cage so I had like kind of crudely uh uh, patched the cage up enough to keep the doe from getting out but there were gaps well, there you can see gaps that were big enough for the uh, the uh, that looks like some blood there too hmm but anyways yeah it looks like blood I didn't even notice that before. Maybe something got in there after him. Even yeah, there's there's blood there for sure. I've been having trouble with coons. Wonder if they reached in there and snagged him out of there. Hmm. I'm gonna have to do something about that right there. I'm gonna have to do something about that coon. There's been a coon coming out of the bottom of that that over there. But anyways. Anyways, I lost some baby rabbits. Hmm. Anyways, so I took the nest box and the the doe out and put it them in here in this better cage and put the buck the buck that was in there. There was a buck and a doe in there because I again I'd gotten them all mixed up. So I put the buck in here, then the two does that were in here, the doe that I took out of there and put in here, the mother doe, another doe, they started fighting. So I had to take the one doe out of here, take the other buck out of this cage, put him in there, and put the other doe in here. So I had to play musical musical rabbits this morning and lost a bunch of baby rabbits so yep it's been an exciting morning with the rabbits that's the little rabbit update okay another rabbit update uh i don't even know what was going on um in the last one i believe she just had her litter and I think that I had found like one dead one in there. Um, I can't even remember how many she had. Like 13 or 14 at least. And 
she had had two in the box and I think maybe at the um, time that I did the last uh, update on video I don't think she'd had the rest of the litter when she did she didn't have the rest of the litter in the box the nest box um, so I picked up all the fur and put it in the nest box and picked up the babies and put them in the nest box and she took them all back out um, uh, she won't, w wouldn't make a nest and put them in their fur, in the fur. Um, so basically, uh, they've just been dropping like flies. I mean, basically that's what it amounts to. I mean, that one seems pretty lively there. I thought there was, oh, there's, there is two, there is one back there, that's a good thing that she's got them back there. Maybe she's going to try to save a couple of them. But she wasn't even keeping these ones warm up here, and it didn't appear that she was, um, feeding them. I don't know, I don't know. We're thinking about, me and, uh, Harold Thornbrew are thinking maybe I should, um, put them in with the other mother I don't know. anyways that's the situation with that one and then I played musical rabbits and had to move them all into um, different cages than they were in because there was end up being so many issues so that's another doe I don't know if she's pregnant or not um, this is the doe that had the first litter, which they did awesome, but something got into into the cage or something happened. I know something. I know that something got into the cage. I'm pretty sure it was a coon. Uh, but it was a good litter. It was an awesome litter. I'm down to three. I don't know exactly what the head count was on the whole litter, but it was at least six to eight, and um, I'm down to three, which they are doing awesome. I think they're hiding back here. Yeah, there, we, there they are. Pretty cute little things too. They have to hide back there. But they're smart after coon took their brothers and sisters. They're, they're pretty smart rabbits. So, um, and then I put the buck in this cage that um that there was some sort of like I said something getting in or them getting out or something, which is got holes chewed in it but I've kind of patched it up but apparently not enough I would had this wire on there before but there was a gap down here and I don't know what the hell happened but bad things definitely happened but we're considering putting the um the um litter from there into here and seeing if the mother will do any damn thing you know, if the mother will take them over or put both the does in there and and uh, I don't know I think Harold's gonna come over in a little bit and try to figure something out he's pulling he's probably gonna pull homestead rescue at least uh, if he brings that trap kill that get that trap that coon that'd be something well that's it for now all right Got a lot of stuff to do today. So I'm gonna harvest some beans first. I fed and watered the rabbits, so I'll get this going on next. Alright, so picked a mess of beans. Alright, pepper right no good. It's kinda of funky on the end. Picked a mess of beans there. Got a zucchini over there that I may may pick out too. I don't know if I can zoom with this camera here. But there's some tomatoes. I'm sitting on a stool by the way. I found out that um at my age picking beans is like hard work better to sit down when you're doing hard work if you can. There's a little garden update. 
This uh, big limb came down up out of this tree during a storm the other day. <coughs> I don't like it there. <clears throat> I'm gonna have a buddy cut that down sometime soon. 